All right, so this one is a Toshiba laptop. We're not interested in a repair. This one is about a data recovery. It's a very old one. Client what came here to ask for a check that's got a USB. Kind of weird question. It's a return client for another job visit. And apparently there's some grandfather's recordings of uh, him reading stories to the grandkids. Maybe it's him when he was a kid. I don't know. Anyway, so basically with this one, we're going to do a charity repair. So we'll call it a charity re uh, repair. We don't ask for money. We just say, oh, look, that's fine. Um, if you want to pay, you can pay whatever you want, but we're not going to charge you anything for it. Of course, this laptop is not worth fixing, but the issue with this guy is we need the data. Data is what's important. Okay. So plug it into power. You get a charging light. It will turn on and it will take forever to respond. And so basically the hard drive is definitely dying on this. And I'm not going to risk it anymore. So we'll see if we can do data recovery for them. <clears throat> Pull the drive out. So it's got a traditional 500 gig, 5400 RPM. Wow, good old days. Now we'll bring a, a dinosaur, a reliable dinosaur. We're going to run a program called KTV USB. Maybe you may have heard of it. I recently discovered it. Pretty cool. It's got a bunch of apps in there. The live window is running on it. F9 <laughs> Yeah, this one here Okay, let's try Let that load. We'll get another USB.
Okay, now. <clears throat> Drive is now plugged in. Let's see if it will get recognized. Still not yet. Hmm, there we go. We can see the drive, that's good. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, so. Let's have a look at Disk Genius. Okay, great. Great. Okay, yep, so that's the account there. Let's bring a temporary drive. Damn, I haven't got any more USB adapters left. Shit. Where am I going to copy to? Um, okay. Oh, use space only 29 gig. Okay. Then we should be able to just right click and copy to. Um, Yeah, this computer here. Make a new folder. Toshiba. Okay, there we go. Hopefully the recovery will finish successfully. Let's see. Prepare to copy. Yeah, so it's been running for some time and yeah no light is blinking and doing its best to copy it, it will hit bad sectors and let me see if i can do anything about options okay ignore um auto rename replace okay because i'm gonna let it run i won't be here so that file unit store bugger off you know what Normally what I will do is I will stop that. We don't want any of this crap, so stop it. Yeah, it's not responding really nicely. Normally the process is you, you know, disk image it. Okay, so what we're gonna do is force. 
okay. It's disappeared. It's okay. This should go mental. Okay. Fine. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so what we're gonna do? Let's plug it back in. This time we're gonna just select like desktop documents, pictures, and copy those. Okay, give it some time. It should refresh. Okay, it's that time of the day, I've got to go. Okay. Data recovery is all about waiting. Okay, so, okay, desktop, documents, favorites, music, pictures, video, document file, I think that's it, SkyDrive, wow, remember SkyDrive, and copy to, Toshiba. Okay, done. There we go. Options. Ignore. Skip. Skip. Okay. All right, we'll let it run, and that should do it. So there is definitely um, audio files there. Cool. Well, that's the end of this video. That's all we can do. And then um, if it fails, I will do um, DD Rescue. Uh, worst case, but I think this should be fine. Just some bad sectors, skip the files of bad sectors. Yeah, the drive isn't that seriously bad condition, just a lot of bad sectors. Okay, um, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to support this channel.